T-minus 35 seconds at T-31. Columbia's onboard computers will have control of vehicle functions. Go for auto sequence start. We have a go for auto sequence start. 20 seconds. T-minus 15 seconds. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, we have a go for main engine start. Four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery, making shuttle history and building our future in space. Houston now controlling. Houston. Roger roll, Discovery. Discovery's roll maneuver is complete. The orbiter is now in a heads down position on course for a 51.6 degree, 200 statute mile orbit and a rendezvous with the International Space Station Friday afternoon. Three engines aboard Discovery now throttling down as the orbiter prepares to pass through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the vehicle in the lower atmosphere. Discovery is already traveling 1,000 miles per hour downrange from the launch site, three and a half miles, currently at an altitude of six miles. Discovery, go with throttle up. Go with throttle up. All three main engines now back at full throttle. All uh, systems aboard Discovery, three auxiliary power units providing electrical power to the orbiter along with the uh, three fuel cells, all performing well. Downrange from the launch site, 10 miles now at an altitude of 14 miles, traveling uh, 2,000 miles per hour. Now one minute, 35 seconds into the flight. At this point, Discovery's already burned more than two million pounds of fuel and weighs half of what it did at launch. Standing by and, uh, for burnout and separation of the twin solid rocket boosters. That coming about 10 seconds from now at the two minute, five second point. confirmation of the SRB separation. Again, the three hydraulic systems and three electrical systems aboard the orbit are in good shape. All three main engines still performing well at 104% of rated thrust. The twin orbital maneuvering system engines now are firing. Discovery, two engine bend. Two engine bend. And that call uh, indicating Discovery can reach Ben Gurir in Morocco in the event of a single engine failure. Again, however, all three uh, still operating at full throttle. Uh, 